Good morning. Welcome back to Dems Biking Adventures. Today we are at Empire 47 in Quebec with a group on a mountain bike instructor training course. This is not the best of pictures of the trails, but as you can see, there's lots of trails here. Uh, excellent riding area. Now, unfortunately, I wasn't able to bring my own bike, uh, and they provided us bikes. Now, these are some really old treks. Uh, this one's 21 speed. Uh, there's not even a uh, clutch on the derailleur. Um, unfortunately, mine had seized fork, so I'm riding with a, a seized fork and a fairly old bike. Um, so it took some time to adjust to it. Now, our first part of this course was uh, doing this little obstacle area. I had a couple corners uh, that we dug into. Um, just get used to cornering with the bike. A um, little bit of uh, uh, some board work there. Uh, just some skinnies and some raised skinnies and some a little one for dropping off. Uh, nice little area. Uh, tour around and like I said, it really got me accustomed to the bike um, and You'll notice a bunch of us just touring around here Now this uh, one thing I should mention is that uh, this bike uh, All the bikes we're using here all just have 26 inch tires um, So going from a 29 to a 26 Wow, what a difference um, a lot of uh, lot uh, I found a lot harder to do rollovers in that versus the uh, 29 but uh, overall it wasn't uh, a terrible bike um, I'd like to say I've ridden worse but uh, I'm not so sure on that one I really like this little area here a um, little bit of a uh, pump track going um, Really got efficient at that, just letting the bike float uh, underneath me. I uh, came up to the corner here uh, once you've done that little pump section. And then we just kept uh, circling back, doing that a uh, few times. So here I am uh, trying out this uh, skinny in the same area, uh, giving it a try. Um, made it over this this rock thing, no problem. Uh, up this rock, climbed up it. Uh, mistake I made here is uh, trying to go uh, to the to the right here and uh, didn't take wide enough, and so I was unsuccessful. This round here, though more confident uh, made it through this section no problem again over that rock up onto this rock this time I took the skinnier to the left and uh, was successful in making it over that skinny so that was uh, totally awesome pretty uh, happy with myself so now we're hitting some of the trails here um, it picked up and it was just pouring rain. So the trails are getting really slick. Uh, a little bit of mud on top. Um, and the tires on this bike, as you can imagine, are, are not meant for this. Uh, so I just adapted my speed to overcome and, uh, you know, rode on. Uh, trails here at Empire 47 are absolutely beautiful trails. Um, Sunday, I'd like to go back there with my my Norco fluid and uh, tackle these trails. Uh, definitely get a lot more flow, I think, than you would with the uh, 26 inch bike. So some of them get steep, you know, steep little steep corners. Um, you can see how much is raining all the puddles on the ground there. Uh, going when I was careful going over this bridge, uh, 
but very nice uh, bridge there. There it goes into a little bit of a steep hill. So again, we're just uh, going along some of the trails, little bridges, uh, rocks everywhere. Um, very, again, a very wet, very wet day. Everything's a little slippery. So this uh, course uh, that we did is uh, it's for the Army cadets. Um, we take this as uh, to be instructors to be able to lead uh, cadets on uh, mountain bike uh, activities. So it's a uh, it's a seven day pretty rigorous course. Uh, different types of trails. Uh, we do green trails, uh, your, your medium, uh, your blue trails type of thing, your medium trails, and then you're, uh, we're challenged to, uh, to do some black trails. And as you can imagine, we get into the black trails, which will be coming out in another video. Um, very challenging on these bikes. Uh, definitely these bikes are not, uh, Nowadays are not up to standards for these type of trails, but uh, they do work. So if you ever get the chance, go to Quebec riding. I'd recommend hitting uh, Empire 47. It's got some really good trails. Definitely spend a day there for sure.
So here we are again near the end of the trail, uh, accomplishing some rock features there. A um, little more rooty section. A little bit of a climb here. Anyways, if you'd like to see more videos like this, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks again for watching. and. Uh, Talk to you soon.